Вы наливаете, я должна выпить, и потом вы ставите вишенку. На One of the most famous clubs in Arcadia, this is the Ibiza Club. This is the amusement park of Arcadia. <laughs> and something fell from the people there. It does have such a beautiful outdoor sitting, so maybe if you're here for just cocktails. Hey all, and welcome to Odessa. My name is Elena, and I'm your expat living and working in Odessa, Ukraine. Arcadia is super busy with tourists, super busy with locals who want to have a good time on a Sunday night, and that's exactly what I want to show you. Now, Arcadia is the prime location for partying in the summer, and I just want to show you the vibe that is happening here. All the best bars, places to eat, and a couple of good beach clubs that you might want to visit. Without further ado, let's go and see it! has set we had some food and we were finally doing the tour right now we are on the track of a uh, health this is a pedestrian street that connects Arcadia to the city center so if you wish to come to some party places in the city center you can definitely take this path however it's only pedestrian and electrical transport uh, or they have an electrical car going all the way there and you can pay a fee and you know go there so the first places that we see are a little bit dingy. <laughs> not looking to offend anyone, but they're kind of a little bit strange. I would not hang out here. So there's like a grill place. There's a karaoke bar, and I always hear like strange music playing here. Uh, but also kind of the places where you can have the food for cheap. Let's check out the prices though. So for 70, 80, 90 grivnias, you can have a whole meal for yourself. One of the famous bars on the strip is Western. It's right here. So during the summer season, they have parties almost every night. Let's check it out. Right now, it doesn't look like they have any concerts. So we'll just go on further. Uh, with this trip of Arcadia is that uh, the track of health is functioning still so there are people even in the evening riding their bikes and riding their uh, scooters and sometimes they bump into people who walk because this this place is super crowded just behind me is another club it's called Red Line also a lot of concerts uh, get organized here I during the weekend I often see lots of young people lining up to go into this club and a new place that opened here, Rebernia. Uh, this is a place that I saw for the first time in Lviv. And now it opened in Odessa. They have a pretty big restaurant and I want to check out their prices. Because they seem like a really nice place back in Lviv. The grilled ribs are uh, 200 grivnias uh, for 400 grams, but this is mostly bone. And also they have beef and mackerel on grill for 300 and 150 grivnias. Um, but I think the best part about this place is the experience because you eat everything with your bare hands. A place where I want to take you is again um, a place from Lviv. It's called Pianna Vishnya. 
we already have something like this in the Arcadia Promenade and now they opened it in Arcadia proper. And their whole point is that they serve this uh, liquor made of cherries or different foods and they put a cherry on top so you're supposed to sip. I'll try to get the experience on camera for you. You drink it, and then you put it on the table. Let's open it. We got our nalivka for 60 grivnias for 150 ml. There are places that sell uh, alcohol on the street and I'm wondering if we can get alcohol for cheaper there. I mean, not that I recommend getting drunk on cheap alcohol, but maybe that would be like an accessible option for some of you. A mojito is 75, Long Island iced tea 110 grivnias, Aperol Spritz 90. Kinkanya has one of the best Georgian cuisine um, for the price that they offer. The um, name of the restaurant Kinkanya is after the uh, traditional dumplings that Georgians have. They are super chip, super filling, super delicious. And I really recommend you go to this place if you don't want to spend a lot of money. Here on the left, another famous club of Arcadia, Itaka. There is a lot of noise going on, so I assume there is an event going on tonight. Another cool place that opened up recently is the City Buffet. This is a buffet and a market, a small shop where you can get things for super cheap and really good quality. I like City Buffet because they always open up in the most nice and historic locations. Fancy! Look at this, it's gorgeous. And a lot of the things that you're seeing here in the interior is the historical interior of this building. I'm not sure exactly what it was, but it looks gorgeous. Um, and they also have sitting outside. I'm sure they offer good prices, but personally, I would not really eat here, especially during the summer. <laughs> I feel like I'm sounding very judgmental in this video, but hey, this is just my opinion, right? Oh, and the last, and I guess like one of the most famous clubs in Arcadia, this is the Ibiza Club. So this club gets the best artists, the best concerts, the best parties. Uh, definitely, if you have a chance, come here. There's actually even a movie where the actors, the, the protagonists of the movie, uh, are driving to get to this club in Odessa. So it's like super famous. behind me we are on the Arcadia Promenade this is the I guess like the best part of the Arcadia for me because there are a lot of restaurants really good ones at that this part of Arcadia is always happening even during the winter season when the tourists are gone and then here is Lviv Croissant which is a place for croissants this is another uh, Lviv uh, shop restaurants also super popular all across Ukraine.
this is the amusement park of Arcadia. <laughs> it's super crazy. Have you seen something fell from the people there? So this is one of the crazier places, but there are also things that are more, you know, tame and calm than all sort of challenges. The winner is going to get an iPhone 12, but I pretty much am sure this is a scam. People pay 100 grivnias for five tries and 150 grivnias for 10 tries. Oh, let's see. Not too bad, but this is the organizer. I'm sure he knows how to do all of this. Yeah, here you can take a ride on the cars. It looks all colorful. It's really nice. During the day when it's super hot, especially in the summer, this domes offer some shade and it's really nice. This is a really good place for kosher cuisine and then Mary Berry which is the Starbucks of Ukraine they have pretty good quality coffee then another place for wine this is the place where I usually get wine in the winter all the glint veins are from here Waffle King is a really good place um, for breakfast like food Um, their waffles start from 80 grivnias and the most expensive one is around 120. So they have one with ham, with salami, with tuna, with chicken and they also have sweet ones. They're almost at the end of the Arcadia Promenade there is an iconic place called Chaika. Uh, Chaika is the name of one of the most luxurious cars in the Soviet Union and they have a car right there. Um, I've not had the best experience with this restaurant to be honest but it does have such a beautiful outdoor sitting so maybe if you're here for just cocktails or drinks uh, it definitely is something that you can check. This is the place they have one in the city center one in Arcadia and they serve breakfast from around the world. Definitely a really good choice really high quality food. I'm sure if you come here you will not be disappointed. Uh, there's something for everyone's taste and for everyone's budget. So thank you so much for watching guys. Let me know what is your favorite place if you've already been to Arcadia and if not, what is a place that you would want to visit, would really impress you, really made you want to come here and taste either their drinks or their food and look at their view. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.